other way. And the Pirates are back on the field, David. Play clock is at 24. We got things straightened out here, All right. David. Pirates threatening. It's second and seven. Trent Griner in the backfield. Griffiths with the snap. Hands off to Griner. Griner pushes forward, still driving. Good push from behind. Gained a few yards. Gain of a what, about three yards again, about David? two or three yards. They spot the ball at the 10. I thought he made it a little further than that. It's going to make it third and uh, probably about five, maybe. Yep. Gain of about two yards there. Third and five for the Pirates. They're pressing pretty hard here, David. Threaten. A lot of clock being used, which that's our game. Griff is looking. Snap. Hands off to Griner. Griner's He's got, got some room. He's still moving. He's still moving. Feet. Short of the first down, though, David, I believe. We're fixing to see where they spot the ball at. Looks like they're going to spot it on the six. Looks around about the eight-yard line to me. Let's see where they put the spot. Yeah, it's only around the seven-yard seven. line. Oh, so that was a gain of three. We'll the difference. So it's six, uh, fourth and two now for the Pirates. Yep. And here comes the truck back in the ball game. A heavy dose of runs taking a lot of play clock yep. off. And we're down here in fourth this down territory, so we're going to go for it, it looks like. It's uh, fourth and two, 5.33 on the clock. Hand off, Brian hit hard. Oh, he's, he's still, still on, on his, his feet, feet, but he is tackled. Goes back. They held us, David. They sure did. Somebody blew in there and hit him. They gambled. There's that train horn. <laughs> Kevin Williams over there, I think he, he can't hear now. <laughs> <laughs> Well, they held us, but we got them pinned back deep down here. Yes, sir. And look where they put the spot. But I'll tell you this about the Pierce County Bears. They're spreading out more now than they ever have. But they may come out in that uh, wildcat formation. And it kind of looks like that. They're coming out in a hurry, too. So yeah, we got to be prepared and ready. Up. Our defense getting ready. And this quarterback I keep hearing about is a very tough Top young man. Green hits his man over. He's got a blocker, but we've knocked him down. Not before he gains about six yards. Kale Creighton hit him first. Who is that receiver over there? Is that Jones Hart Heron? I like that last name. Yep. That was Heron. Well, they come out quick on us too, didn't they? They, they were ready. They, they were in a hurry. Folks, we're looking through a fence down here. So live action, we're having a look at the screen. So. Yep. It's hard to tell. They're spreading us out a good bit here, David. Yeah. What about oh, it looks like a lot of movement there. Himself. We've seen him do that before. He's got a first down, I think. The no call on that. Seen a lot of movement before the ball was yep. snapped. But I'm, and we've seen him do that a lot. Take yes, a snap and run straight up the middle. They're, they're paying back the uh, honors on us, just pushing yep. the ball down the field on us. They're going to place the ball on the 27. Going to be first and 10 for the Bears. Bears taking their time to huddle. Heard a lot Play about this uh, down. quarterback, this Caden McGathy. He come in from Alabama also. Yep. Said he's a tough young man, too. You they, can tell it. They run to the line. A whistle blows. And they're going to send a player they, There's off. some reason they keep doing that. I, I don't understand. Is it a legal substitution or something with I, clothes? Yes. Or? I, I don't know. We need to find out what's yeah, going on there. All right, they're running in that wildcat that we're used yep. to seeing. There it is. He takes it, tried that left side. He cut back towards the middle, and we hit him. He lunges forward for a few. Not sure some extra yeah. or activity there, but. Somebody got hit, and Pierce County fans are wanting a flag. Don't know what was happening there. All right, they're gaining yards on us, David. It's second and about uh, six for the Bears. We know they're going to hurry up at us. Yep. I'll tell you what, if you look at uh, Max Preps and then you look at their roster that we got, the sizes they have is way off. 
Oh, yeah. There's Another quarterback sneak. Look at that left side. Runs back that middle. He is hit hard. The ball's loose, too, oh, David. Can we get on it? We're yes, right. the Pirates have Pirates got on the ball. It. Three Pirates on the field. Number 16. My goodness, Jamarcus, Jamarcus Robinson. Robinson, the hitter. Pirates come away with the ball. Let's Here's see. Here's the replay right here. He takes it, goes to the left, and he sees that whole cuts back in there. And look at there. Now, who knocked it? That, that was number 45. That no, sir. That was number 19, Grayson Hall, with a great hit. I seen Burke coming in from round backside. It looked like he might have punched it. All right, folks. It is a 0-0 ball game. 3-10 here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Right. Here in the first quarter, it is a 0-0 ball game. Pirate offense back on the field. Trent Griner in the backfield. Kind of figured this was going to be a, a defensive battle anyways. Two great defenses here, David. Oh, yeah. And we got a timeout running in. Yep. called timeout by Pierce. the Bears. Folks, for the first time, we're going to take a break. We're going to be right back with some Pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Insures your small business. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. It is first and ten for the Pirates around the 40-yard line. All right. Trent Griner in the backfield. Hands off to Griner. Somebody wrapped him up on the 40. They wrap him up right at the yep. line of scrimmage. Right at the line of scrimmage. Man, what a job by that defense uh, for – for Bears, they you know they they're showing up here now. Yeah, there. This is this is a high we knew, game. Everybody's going all out. Yes, sir. We knew what it was going to be when we got here, and I'll tell you, you know, I, I put it to, to it like this: we we got a bunch of country boys here. Yeah, so we know this is going to be uh, all we want, and they same with us. Yep, back and too. I love it because there's a lot of heart in those country boys too. If you know Hand what I mean. The grinder, grinder hit again at the line. Our offensive line is breaking down a little bit now, David. We keep trying to beat the middle. I see Jamarion Williams coming in the ball game now. Nehemiah Howard going to third the down and uh, third and eleven here. Third and eleven here. Two eleven in the first quarter. Kellen Eccles out to the right. That's Griffiths. Griffin's got oh, the jump again. Caught him again, David. Should be an extra five yards for the Pirates. Yep. Can't tell what the officials call. Yeah, they do call encroachment. Yep. I saw him jump. We needed those extra five yards. It may change up the play calling. That's going to bring the ball out to the 36. Got a... We got uh, play, two to the left, one to the right here. Play clock down to 10 seconds. That's a snap. Jamari with the ball because yep. he got some running room. He stays on something. his feet, and he's pushing defenders. He's still on his feet. They push him out of bounds. Was it enough for a first down? I don't believe so. I don't think so. Let's see where they're marking him out at. I think it's going to be like he's going to be about a yard or two short. No, actually, uh, David, I believe is third and about four. Is it? I'm hard. To, I'm trying to look down the line here, and you can't really tell by the down markers. Yeah, we're we're right side. on the um, our side, the visitor side. Yeah, and we can't see the down markers from where we're sitting. So we're 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 fighting that battle, folks. But we know it's fourth and four, and the Pirates are going for it. They know what's uh, at store. Let's see what the Pirates come out with. Griffiths looking to throw. He's got a man over. Oh, and it was overthrown. Looking for Kellen Eccles. He had a wide open Eccles over there. 
Just over thrown. Good coverage on him, but he just overthrew him. All right, that's going to be a turnover on downs again. It's 120 here in the first quarter. Pirate defense back on the field. They're going to come out in a hurry. We know that now. The Pirates. Uh, yeah, they sprint out and they line up. They're ready for anything at this moment. They are actually going to spread us out a little bit, David, again. That's number seven. Quarterback is going to throw one. There's that little screen. Oh, and it's knocked away by number 19, Grayson Hall. Great coverage there. Grayson would have got in front of that. He could have took that to the house. Tell you what, Grayson has having a season so far, ain't he? Great season so far. Great young man. Got injured in that Ware County game and just walked uh, through it. And well, just, what he did is he dislocated his shoulder oh, a little yeah. bit, and they popped it back in, and he was ready to go. He played again. again. Talk about these country boys, and that's, you know, this is South Georgia football at its finest. These are tough young men on both sides of the field, David. Yep. I believe that with all my heart. All right, it's second and ten for the Bears. There's a snap. That quarterback take takes it. Again, up the middle again. And he gains yep. probably about uh, nine yards there, David. Tackled by Jamarcus Robertson. He's coming to the left and just cutting right back, and he's got a gap right there, and he's hitting that hole every time. That's it. See how he does right there and just shoots back through the gap. Got to get off those blocks there, They're David. Spreading us out. So they give him a first down, I believe. Yep. Pierce County runs in with a play from the sideline. Bears nice. hurry to the line. Snap once again. Oh, again. and the judge Jerry had him, but he let go. He couldn't hold on to him. Had a guy hitting him from behind. We had him for a loss, but Darion, on, Darion had him in the backfield, David. He just couldn't grab a hold of him. Grab a hold of him. He bounced off. The guy's real elusive. And they're running plays. I know it's from the uh, second down. I think it's second and three. Second and three. Yeah. Looks like uh, we've got a – nope, we're going to take it into the second quarter, folks. Yep. It's a 0-0 ball game. Uh, we're going to take a break, guys, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you Welcome back, Pirate fans. Look like we got double stacked to the right and left here. Another formation. Usually some trick plays out of this. Hands off to number 30. Something. And he is tackled immediately by number eight. Cameron Mobley. Cameron the Mega Man Mobley. Gain of no about none. Appreciate you folks joining us here. Going to bring up third and one. Actually, they gained him two there, David. I'm having a hard time getting this yardage up. <laughs> yeah, you have. Cole's doing a great job of that. I can't see yeah, the, the sideline. Looking at it, it's hard to tell sometimes. So, again, we're, we're going to do our best on that to give that to you. I know Cole is the best at it. All right, they're going to line up again in that bunch. That's on the 46. Third and one. There's a snap. It keeps it itself, number two. 
Oh, he just about cut loose, but he got a first down, but he was tackled uh, by Mobley. Cameron Mobley. Yep. That was number two for them, Jai Evans. All right, they run a couple people on. All right, here we go, David. First and 10 for the Bears. First time they've been on our side of the field so far. And they're doing a heavy dose of run. We just got to get off some tackles and Wrap up just like that. Now We've got a flag. comes in from behind. Maybe, that it looks may, like that might be holding. Hey, it was in the area of that, David, for sure. Be a good time to back him up. It is a holding call. Yep. That's so going to back him up a little bit. It's going to make it first and first and uh, twenty. First and B and B. <laughs> That's how yeah. far we are away from them. A lot of heavy running here, David. Nobody's taking a chance in the air yet. It takes a, you know, it makes the game go quick when you're running the ball. That's right. Clock just ticks away. Hadn't had a whole lot of chance to call any names no. or numbers a whole lot tonight. Everybody's been kind of conservative here so far. All right, it's second and uh, excuse me, first and twenty. Snap's gonna keep it himself. We hit him immediately, and he's tackled. Whistle comes, blows quick. Tackled by number five, Darion Smith, the judge. Little to no gain, so be second and. Uh, Quiz Van was in on there too. Is that second and fifteen? Yep. They know second and eighteen. They give him a gain of two. I'm sorry. Yep. Apologize, folks. Again, we are trying to get our markers squared away. It's David's fault. He's blind <laughs> and old. <laughs> I am right here. <laughs> All right, second and 18 for the Bears. Hadn't heard a whole lot out of this man yet, Bears but I know he's coming. Line. Looking to throw, looking to throw. Drops back, throws it deep. This is the first deep Swing ball. He's wide open. Oh, and off. he catches it. Oh, my goodness. Ja Evans with double defenders on him. But no call on a hold from a mile away. <laughs> I think we have something here, a flag, David. Ineligible yep. receipt. Oh, my goodness, oh, negated yeah. that great throw. That brings them back. I seen the I seen the laundry coming. come out. I thought it was a hold. That's what I was calling, guys. Somebody I apologize. Field it wasn't supposed to be, and oh, my goodness, what a throw and Man, a catch. That was a big catch. Good throw, too, brother. Yeah, I, sure was. I'm going to give credit where credit is due. That young man. Reared back and throwed it, and that, that receiver. That receiver just stretched out. He had Trayshawn and uh, number 16 for the Pirates, uh, yeah, he, Jamarcus, he outrun. He beat, yeah. That was a good job by him, too. So. so that's going to bring the ball back to the 45. Another five yards back. Uh, should make it second and 23. Is that right? That's about right. Yep. All right, now it looks like we're going to have a timeout. I believe it's going to be. Pierce County. No, actually, yes, yeah, it is Pierce County, Pierce timeout. County timeout. Folks, we're going to take a break with them, guys. We'll be right back with some pirate action. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Football is all about teamwork. 
Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Falls from Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Welcome back, Pirate fans. It is second and 23, 8.56 in the, here in the second quarter on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Direct Bears. snap to the quarterback. Looking again, and we snuff him up. And that's Tried number 51 for the Pirates. That is number Our quiz fan. The boogeyman. The boogeyman. As we like to call little to no gain there. See Jalen Bennett there, big number 55. Get him fired up here in a minute. Yeah, I'd hate to make that young man mad at me. He's, he's one of them. Once he fires up, he's he's tough. He's got a lot of wheels on him. Yeah, he does. A lot of in and out substitution by the Bears. They're running that wildcat on us. Okay, the snap handoff. We hit him. Stack him up. And it. number eight, Cameron Mega Man Mobley and Trayshawn yeah. the real deal Moore in there on the tackle. Trayshawn Moore, let's say congrats to him. A couple of offers. This week, matter of fact. Yep. Got his first D1 offer. I'm proud of him, David. That I am too. That's what we want to see for these young men that, you know, get the opportunity, David, uh, just to be able to square up and have a time to go and uh, further their yeah. career, the ones that love to play and, you know, put a lot of hard work into That's it. That's right. Got this camera angle here we love. Mm-hmm. They're going back to punt. Back deep is Hickox. Punts the ball, the first punt of the night. Bounces. Hickox going to pick it up. Going to try to run around the edge. He's got some room, got David. Room. Oh, my goodness. And he's a track He's star. still on his feet. He's he could go. Run into his own man. Oh, my Tackle goodness. 40. Cut back up. I've running. never seen so much dust behind some feet in my life. Oh, he knows it, too. Kind of run tripped up on his own man. He knows it, too. He's, yeah, he does. He was taking it to the house. Well, good field position. That's that 4x400 uh, four four speed. It is. They um, dares to take uh, credit on that. Yep. <laughs> and the 200 uh, uh, state champion. Pirates going to line up real Camden quick. Hickox, Code Red. Pirates take over around the, the 40. The band director's son. That's exactly right. His younger brother is good, upcoming in the middle yeah, school. Yeah, his eighth grader. Yeah. And whistles blow. Uh, let's see what Looks we Looks like here. we may have a timeout, timeout by Pierce the Bears. King. Yep. Guys, we're going to break with them. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Welcome back, Pirate fans. We just come off the uh, timeout here in the second quarter. See what Dason the, uh, has in store here. See what play call we got. We got Jamarian in the backfield. There's a snap. Hands off to. Oh, oh no. Dason's got the ball. First he's got nothing but open field, David. He's oh, he's tripping. Fumbling. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. Dason uh, Griffiths with the stumble, rumble, bumble. The turf monster <laughs> got him. <laughs> you wait until I see him next week. <laughs> He was he was good. He could see end zone and just man, he faked you out. <laughs> he did. Well, he's I done saw that a couple of times. I got that one. Well, on I had a feeling that was going to happen, but I'm going to tell you what, Jamari on Williams, he fakes good. He does a great job. Dason's a good general back there. All right, it's first and goal for the Pirates. Yeah. Scoring position here. Let's see what the Pirates can punch it in for a touchdown. 
Snap, hands off to Marion Williams. He's Bounce still on his people. feet. Lunges forward to the – they're probably going to put it on the three. I we'll would say two and a half yard line maybe. Yep. Yep. Going to be right. Good run. Pirates standing strong here. Let's hurry it up. And I think that's what we're going to do, yep. David. We're going to hurry up on them. Catch him off guard. Maybe we can uh, punch his ball in. Hands off to Williams. Williams. He's in for a touchdown. Pirates score first here in the second and quarter. I was on the cannon, but we don't have it here. Boom. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Every time we score, I want you to holler boom. Boom. Okay, I can't do it much louder than that. All right, your Pirates lead six to nothing. Extra points coming up here, David. Yep. Here in the second quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Here's your replay. They hand it off to Jamar in the truck, Williams. And that left side of that line just uh, opened up a mammoth hole for him. Oh, yeah, untouched. Untouched almost there. All right. All right, extra point here. Alan Ramirez to kick, snap, hold, kick is up. Straight up. And it's good. Straight through the middle. Your Pirates lead, folks. We're going to take a break right here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. It's a 7 nothing ball game, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Pirate fans, we're back. It's pooch kick over to the right side. No fair catch call. Fielded. This young man's got, got some room. room. And he is tackled. Is that a loose ball? We're piling I up don't there know. somewhere. It Pirates looks like the Pirates we may got have ball. They're calling for it. Pirates are signaling Pirate ball. Let's see. Apple County saying their ball. See what the officials They've say. They've got the ball. No, they're giving it to the they're Bears. It to Pierce County. Not sure what happened there, but hey. Appling County, the players even come up signaling. And I the player the come up with judge the ball. Look over to the other guy from behind, and I don't Michael know. Michael Moy came up with the ball there, too, David, so I don't yeah, know what I, happened. I don't know. Unless he called him down. That official from the side judge. Couldn't over tell there. from our angle, David, so it uh, looks like Pierce has got the ball. First well, and 10 for Pierce. A big play. Pierce County on the line. Number seven, the quarterback. Looks like he's going to do the same. Takes the snap, runs to that left side, and then cuts back to the middle. And the Pirates tackle him. Late hit there, but no call. Several Pirates on him. One of them, Darion Smith, I see coming up out of the pile. And uh, Jacquez Van again in there. And you had number five, uh, Darion Smith. Second and seven. Heard the announcer say second and six, but. 5.33 on the clock. A heavy dose of run from both teams Pierce so far, County, David. Same setup. We've seen this so many times. Yes, them. sir. This is a famous. Uh, snap. He runs to this side this time. Oh, and a hit there. Good yardage. But Cameron Mobley coming need. in pretty hard, but not for uh, not much of a gain, but it was. It, it was a hard fault four yards for the uh, yep. number seven, Caden Magatha. Bennett's got to come off the field. His helmet come off. You got Cameron Seven George feet. coming in. Also a, a hard-hitting young man. Cameron's a sophomore for the Pirates this year, David. Yep. We've got a lot of really, really good young ball players. There's All a right. snap. Runs to the side again. We drag him down. That was uh, Nehemiah Howard, I think, got him. I believe you're right. Cameron Mobley in there again. Coming in from that linebacker position. I think it was enough for a first down there, David, I yeah, believe. Yeah, moving the chains. Yeah, it's first and ten. <laughs> you 
got number 55 back in there. Jalen Bennett. Usually when you see a helmet come off, you got to watch and pay attention in that middle of that line That's to right. see who's grabbing. You got to tighten up them chin straps too, right, David? That's right. We've had several helmets come off. All right, they're so staying far. in the same formation here. A heavy dose of this, but this is a runner too. It's like going to that. He just don't have the DJ side. bell we, speed. Oh, my hit goodness. Him and he's still running over our guy. He is. T <laughs> he's hard to tackle. And we were told that. Kid runs hard. We hit him, and he just bounced off and just kept yes, going. Sir. Right there, we hit him to start with right there. Somebody hit him, didn't wrap up. Gain of about five. He hit him head on, too. Yep. Tell you what, you know, that's, that's what they call old man football, right? Yep, man gets low and just <laughs> runs over, which we do that to people, too. We that's got right. Jamari on Williams will run over you in a heartbeat. That was a good job by that young man. All right, second and four for the Bears. Drops back, He's looking to pass. He dumps it over underneath to Sloan. Oh, and Treshawn misses the tackle. But number 16 comes in there. For a first down. Jamarcus Robertson slips out of uh, Treshawn's fingertips. But he gains enough for a first down for the Bears. He's caught got Carson Sloan just coming across in the crease there and just dumped it over to him. Nothing fancy. Those are dangerous throws, too, with the defense. Yep. Well, we're going to have to wrap up. We're missing tackles. The first man's hitting him good, and then we're just not hanging on. All right, folks, if you're just joining us, uh, second quarter, 2.55 on the clock. The Pirates struck first, and the Bears are attempting to now. It's running in this same wildcat formation with number two back there. Had a Takes man. A snap again, runs to the side. That wildcat formation still on his feet. We got to get some penetration here. Because them young men are pushing us backwards. Looks like uh, Appling County's going to call a timeout. They must have given us our timeout back a while ago, David. Had to be an official timeout. We're going to yeah, take a break was. with them, guys. Your Pirates lead 7 to nothing here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We'll be right back with some Pirate action. We insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Community centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. It's 227 here in the second quarter left. Pirates lead seven to nothing. The Bears uh, are pu pushing the ball pretty hard down the field on us. Uh, it's second and third for the Pierce County Bears. They're going to spread us out a little bit. We got yeah, to got two out to the right. Going to have to maintain this quarterback. He's a good quarterback back there, David. Yeah, he's um, he's a good general too for them. Doing running that wildcat once again. He's looking to throw. Looking. Oh, to throw. and it's caught. I don't know if GHSA needs to get a hold of this, but that's a little hard right there. If I lose here and I'm I'm suing, yeah, <laughs> I'll say that live. <laughs> I didn't see the I didn't see the catch. Great, hey, great throw and great catch, but we were right here up under this thing, and I'm telling you guys, I I got a headset on and it's loud, and kids are right here. Yep. Also, you back, can lose some here. And, and had a man just number beat 19, us. Grayson Hall. And it was on the money. Nothing you can do about that. No good. It's oh. seven to six. Your Pirates lead here. All right. I don't. Well, we knew we wasn't going to keep them, shut them down. That's right. Well, guys, we're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. It is a seven six.
football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Falls Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. Pierce is uh, struck here and got six points. Missed the extra point. There's a kick back deep, deep. Fielded right there by, I'm not sure. They got bears all around us. Tackled uh, on number 25. 25. Number 25 for the Pirates. That is uh, Kamani Riles. And tackled on the 25. Twenty-five on the twenty-five. Twenty-five on the twenty-five. All right. There's a penalty, a personal foul on Appling County. Oh wow! This is happening. I wasn't even paying attention, David. Yep. So that's going to drop us way back. Back to about the 10-yard line. That'll drive a coach crazy. All right. Clock ticking down. Two minutes. We're going to spread them out a little bit here, David. 2-12 on the play clock here. Jamarion Williams in the backfield. They're loading up the box on us. Stacked the run. Hands off to Williams. He He's got some crease. room. He's still on his feet. And they're grabbing at the ball. That was a gain of about 10 yards for a first yeah, down for the Pirates. Gain. We needed that back. Great job by Jamar and Williams, the truck. It's a minute and uh, – That's going to leave a second and 10. Minute 48 on the clock. Pirates know they got to kick off. We need to get some points here, David, you reckon? Oh, yeah. I need to strike right here. They're playing up close on us and playing man on us. I, I'm waiting to see something deep go. Yep. Williams got a man in motion. There it is. Griffiths dropped back, looking, looking. Oh, looking. he's got Griffiths a man. Up. Number 11, Hercules. Hercules. Nearby Howard. Hercules. <laughs> Been waiting to call that name all night. What a job. Grayson steps back. Griffiths dropped it in there. There he is. Nehemiah Howard come around. Wide just open, man. Curl out there and just throws it right to him. Little under thrown, but he wow. turned around and got the ball. Gain of about 55, 53 yards there. Not sure what the coach is mad about here, but uh, he's calling time a out timeout. Appling County. Oh, the clock was running. It shouldn't have been. Oh, okay. I see it now. So that was an official timeout, not yeah. a, not a uh, pirate timeout. Well, they so turned let's... like it was signaling for us, and I'm like, okay, that don't make sense. Not sure. Got to get these officials in the game too with us. They... We're gonna stay with them here. Get the uh, clock Cole? right. Yeah, we're gonna stay here with you guys. Let them uh, let work this sort out. It, they, sort it they, out. They they're the ones that take this game. And I uh, appreciate it, not me. So <laughs> I could mess it up too, couldn't I? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it kind of messes up your momentum as you're going. Well, Chris, if you see this, both sides of the stands have got cheers going back and to each oh, other. Man. There goes the Pirate fans screaming and hollering. Great shot there by Kevin Thompson. All right, folks, the Pirates are getting ready to – Take the field again. It's first and 10 from around the 38-yard uh, line. Having to look back at the scoreboard, David. <laughs> I know. I keep looking back. It's right behind us. Uh, it's 110 on the clock, too. That's the other thing I was looking at, the correct time. Uh, don't blame the coach for being a little upset there. Looks like we're going to have a little bit of double, double teaming over here on the left side. Yep. Let's see what we can He's dive moving up in. Here. Dason's got to get rid of the got ball. A man coming around. He's looking. He throws. Oh, it is caught. 
My goodness! What a catch by Camden, Camden Code Hickox. Red Hickox gets off of his guard. Wow! Look at this, David, on the replay. Dason steps up, throws it. Cam just drops back and just makes he the play. He stretches out. My goodness. All right, it's uh, first and goal for the Pirates. We move Trying to get our man set. Get everybody set. Snap, hands off to Williams. Oh, no. Oh, he kept it. The Dyson. man, the myth, Step. the legend, Dason <laughs> Griffiths, the gunslinger the in for keeper. a touchdown. The keeper. <laughs> What a job by Dason Griffiths with the Untouched. fake. Untouched. You said he handed it off, and I was paying attention again, David. Can you like believe it? it? it. All right, it's 13-6 to six for your Pirates with 39 seconds left in the third quarter. What a job by Alan Dason Ramirez, Griffiths. Is the Razor. Got to see his mama tonight. She's here. Snap, the hold, the kick is up and right down the middle. Looks like we may have had a whistle blowed, but the point's good. May have been offsides on them. It is now 14 to 6. Your Pirates lead here in the first half of this game with 39 seconds on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Cole, we're going to take a break and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. A good high, long pooch kick back here to Field it by man going to the left over there. We Pirates has got to get on him, and they do run him out of bounds around the 34, 35-yard line by Treshawn Moore. What a job by your Pirates. Probably going to have to play a little bit of prevent, but they do know they get the ball back in the second half. They That's won right. the toss, so. There's nothing crazy here. Step back, don't give up anything deep. We know they're a talented ball team, and they've got some weapons over there, David. Sure that do. number uh, two, Ja Evans, man, what a receiver. And number, number eight, seven. Joe Drew, and that quarterback. I mean, yeah, you can't say enough about He's that good. young man. I want to give a big shout-out to another young man from Pierce County, it's DJ Bell, proud of what he's doing yes, in college DJ. right now. I got to watch him run one back, proud of you, young man. All right, Pierce County, snap, going to keep it. We hit him, spin him around. He's still on his feet trying man, to get away. Man, that's a tough young man, Boy, he's slippery, David. I mean a tough young man. Cameron Mobley comes out of there. Hey, uh, Caden McGathy. Yep. McGatha, I think I'm pronouncing that right. I apologize if I do get it wrong. But he is a – McGatha. Uh, he's a hard – He is a junior is what we're showing right Well, here. guys, they're going to take it into the house and uh, – they're happy to have a 14-6 ball game so far. Pirates and the Bears are getting off the field. Folks, we're going to uh, take a halftime break, and we're going to bring you unedited, un-talking uh, pirate action, the band. The band. Man, we love our band. We love the Pirate Brigade. What an awesome job they do, number one in the blend. They've come over here and won uh, two, uh, several competitions yes. at the Pierce uh, band competition they have over here, which they, they put on a great show here. And a great thing uh, here in Pierce County. Yep. Guys, you stick with us. Uh, we'll be back for the second half. Uh, appreciate uh, all you do in joining us, and we appreciate the BNB broadcast. The Empire fans better stay on their feet and get louder in this second half. We need all the energy we can get. David, anything? That's it. Let's watch this um, Pirate band right here. Yes, Pirate sir. Brigade. Go Pirates.
Auto Owners insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you Community centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the Baxley and let's do it. Do it. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you.
Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, Family Nurse Practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Falls Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, Family Nurse Practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Falls Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it.
Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Auto Owners insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if Auto Owners make sense for you. your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Falls Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the Baxley and let's do it. Do it. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor.
All right, we just found out our mics wasn't on, guys. Sorry about that. But we had a good conversation. We did going have on. a good I conversation. I mean, it was really good. I mean, but you got to see the action without yeah, us. I did. That's there's, right. There's a lot that of might have been a good. That's about a bit of plus. <laughs> yeah, it's second and three for the Bears. Our defense getting set down. They're still running in that wildcat a little bit, David. Yep. Snap keeps it. Oh, a low cut. We stack him up. Was a quick blow. whistle. Hit by Jalen Bennett, number yes, 55, sir. and that's what we've been waiting on him to come alive. Yes, sir. I'll tell you, uh, great, great job. Oh, they give him a first down, David. Didn't know he made that. I didn't either. Good job sure. by that young man, Caden McGathy. I know I'm not pronouncing that right. He's a junior here that for the Pierce County Bears. great athlete. He man. is, man, man. I'll tell you. He's impressive. He's uh, something to watch here. All right, fired defense still in that same formation. Got to watch them. They, they do pass out of this sometimes. Look like a little bit of movement snap there. Right straight up the middle. We drive them back. Give him a good spot there too, Dave. A gain of about two yards, uh -huh. what I can tell. Sorry about the uh, no sound, folks. Uh, we we just noticed it. Yep. We're second. back live, though. You're good. Second down. You and didn't want to hear David anyways. Look, I actually, I actually said some really good stuff. And not just, about me, though. Oh, no. That's not going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually give him three yards, David. It's second and seven. All right. Bears to the line. No change on the offense. Still running Snap. the same thing, just running different man out. Left side. Looking Gotta for some running room, him. jump one or two people, and we stack him up there on the – Getting a little did quicker he make on him the, to the 50? Ah, he's close. I uh, think they're going to mark him on the 50. They did. They put him right there on the 50. Great run by number two, Ja Evans. A little, uh, little bit of does a little bit of everything. That's right. Usually when a man throws his hands in there, it's kind of a hold, but they didn't call it there. Nah, it, and that's going to be a first down for the Bears there. Good job. Hey, it's not holding if they don't call it, right? Uh, that's exactly right. Got to get off those blocks. Tell you what, I had some great conversations with some of the Pierce County folks here a while ago and on. I mean, really good folks over here. Appreciate what they do. Um, All right, first and 10, David, for the Bears. Got a new man back there, number 30. Takes snap, runs that short side. He broke loose. We get him, but he got he got some good gain. That is uh, Javion Williams. Looks like he's a freshman for them. He's quick. He's a small back, but he, he got through that he hole. He is quick. He hit the line wide open. <clears throat> Another first down for the Bears. They're trying to attack us. Yeah, there. We got to get off some of these blocks, but they're doing a great job on that line for yep. the Bears. Let's see what this defense can dial up now. Bears to the line real quick. Same setup. Wildcat formation. Looking to throw. He played it. Hit a man. Dropped it. We almost intercepted that ball. Uh, whistle was blowed real quick there. Jamarcus Robertson come diving in. Almost caught that ball. Again, you got to be careful because they will come out of there and throw. Well, he faked like he was going to run it and then pulled up and I, tried I, to dump it over. And he had a man there. You know, DJ Bell was dangerous with that play. Yes, he was. The one thing about him, if you if you got up on him and, and didn't contain him, he was gone. Yes, he was. That young man had some feet on him. All right, it's second and ten for the Bears. Snap to number two. Number two's looking short oh, side. Oh, he's running. knocked out of bounds by number two for the Pirates, uh, Mikel Creighton. Hadn't called his name. No. I love seeing that kid run the ball. Mikel Creighton. Yes, sir. Spotted on the 31-yard line. They're still making forward progress. Creighton's going to come out of the game for a second. I think he got a little bit of shook, shooken up there. Hey, yeah, might get him a stinger there. I don't know. Yeah, he reached out and tackled him. All right, they're saying same, same formation. They're not getting away from it. They sure are. Young man. There he goes, snap. Run around the side, the end. He's tackled, but still a gain. Yeah, they're slowly gaining. You don't stop it if it's working, right, David? That's right. If it ain't broke, you don't fix it. That's that number 30, uh, 
Javon well, Williams. You know, that's typical Pierce County ball right there, and we've yes, seen sir. them in the past. If they got something that's working, they'll grind it, grind it, grind hey. it until you stop it, then they'll go to something else. That's right. Hey, that's smart coaching in my book. That is very smart coaching. That's Another exactly. one of those famous guys we had here, Rick Tomlin, the same way now. He 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 tell you, you better be prepared for some uh, grown man football. That's right. And I, I did like that pound and ground, ground and pound that he used to do. He had to be tough to play football for that man. Snap, takes it right up the middle. Oh, that kid's still grinding. David, look at him go. Still on his feet. We're not pulling him down. We're going to have to go a little harder at him and hit him a little harder than that. Somebody's That's, lid come off over there. That was number 45 for the Pirates, uh, Edwin Burke. We can't let up. we yep, got to quit you arm tackling. The right there. Yes, sir. That young man has no quit in him. He just keeps driving them feet, driving them feet. Young players out there, watch this. This you is know, what I've, you're supposed I've to do. I've noticed that just about every one of those plays that went to the left side. I yep. think they're uh, moving some beef over there to the right side a little bit. Going to change mm -hmm. them up. You got number two back there in the backfield. Yeah, got to watch for a pass here. Ja now. Evans. What about Taysen? Up the middle. We hit him immediately. Uh, probably about a two-yard gain. Yep. They seen the change up there, David. Mm -hmm. We got some players moving some players in and out now. They're hey, they're power football at us right now. Yep. Great to come out. Trying Great to slow Bruton us down in the ball game. Second down and seven. Snap, runs to the right side looking for a hole. He was grabbed immediately it, there. Pushing him. He might have got a yard. What They've been getting a lot of two. favorable spots there on that. That was number eight with the ball carry, Joe Drew. Got one getting up a little slow. Is that Nehemiah Howard? Yeah, that's Nehemiah Howard. Oh, my goodness, we don't want to see him. No, we don't need limping. to see him. Should be an official timeout there to give a young man time to get off. Yep. He should have went down there. All right, it's third and four. Maybe he's okay. A Maybe. lot of clock off of here, folks. It's 526 on the clock right now. Pirates are standing strong so far. Got to hold them here. Know they've got some type of trick play coming in here on a third and four down. Yeah, let's see what they're going to do here. I don't know. They're keeping that quarterback keeper is working well for them. He that. did. He threw it up in there. It is knocked away Wait. by number 16, Jamarcus Robinson. Wow. He was wide open, though, it David. Sure was. I knew something was coming in a form of a pass. Like that old Tim Tebow jump pass. Yes, sir. Are they going to bring on the kicking team and take those three points? He was wide open. What a great job by Jamarcus. Looks like they are going to bring on the kicker, uh, try and at least get three points. Pretty smart. Yes, sir. I take the points all day you long. You got to take your points. You can't go away empty. But watch them right here too. Yeah, they're not. They're not giving in on it much. Look like somebody. Oh, yep, they did go they a fake, trip. but they got us off sides, David. That could be enough for a first down. Not sure it's if it's on us or them. We're fixing to get a call here. The officials are gathering up to talk yep. about it, and I don't know who jumped and first. The Pirates are pointing it was on them, on Pierce County. Oh, wow, they call it on the Pirates. And that's going to be a Pierce County first down. They did have a fake in play right there, David. Yeah. So we're gonna see what we're doing here. They're going to oh, they're the giving the first down, David. That's they're giving the first down. Yeah, four the yards. The Five field. yard penalty gives them the first down. But there was a motion or man in motion over there and moved uh, the left tight end and draw drawed us off. But they didn't see that. So hey, again, no. you got to keep playing. Now it's first down. That's right. 
Pirates could uh, come away with a strip here or anything. They're coming out real quick. Got to get and set. And probably going to be another keeper here. It is. Number seven. Keeps it. Going around. The <laughs> Pirates have got to be resilient. It's going to make it 12 to 14. You got to be watching for anything here. They could try another fake yeah, to get for, two. Go for two here. And tie this tie. ball game up. Their kicker number 33, David. Yep. So them Cade deferring. Meeks. So them deferring paid off here. They drove the ball down and scored. David, there's not anybody out there to spot the ball. Oh, there he is. That is uh, Sloan, I believe it is. Snap. Oh, they, they are it. faking it. I knew they would. And, and they're in. in. That horn's rough right here. I'm those. telling y'all, brother, it's those horns. I may have to cut a hose in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> That's a little too loud for me. Guys, we're going to take a break. It's a tied ball game. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Welcome back, Pirate fans. They come in and tied it up on us. Great job. By the Bears. Yep. Tied up. We knew not to uh, look for anything. They're going to throw everything but the kitchen sink, and they've done yeah, that. Yeah, you can see it. Noobs. Watch for another pooch kick or something funny here because they're going to throw everything but the kitchen sink at us, and they have so far. And they come away with an eight-point score. Deep down here. Fielded. About the 10, running to the right side. One missed him. That was number 25 for the Pirates, yeah. Kimoni Riles. Let's see what the Pirates can dial up here. David. Give them momentum. I think I'm going to eat a gummy lifesaver. <laughs> That's what I brought them for, buddy. That's it. All right, this is the first time the Pirates have been on offense in this uh, half. Uh, Pierce took a lot of clock off there to tie this ball game up, to make it a 14-14 ball game. Pirates, nothing stupid here now. Pirates, we're in control, David. Yep. Damarian Williams up the middle. He's still moving the ball. Yep. Tackle, but a gain of about two. Pierce County fans are on their feet. Appling County fans are on their feet, too. This yeah, is standing no game. room only. Nobody's sitting. No, sir. Got to get on your feet, Pirate fans. We, we, knew, knew, this, it, we knew this game yeah, was going to be tough. It's going to be a nail-biter. We can't it think that we is. can roll over them just by a lead. Second and 10 or second and eight. They did give us two yards there, David. Yep. Oh, they had a man blow. Got a whistle. Looks like uh, somebody, offsides. Yeah, it was bad offsides. That's going to be a five-yard penalty. Yeah, he was at the quarterback for the ball was snapped. All right, we'll take a few more of those, David. Oh, yeah. They'll give them. We'll take them. Going to make second and about three for the Pirates. Jamarion Williams in the backfield. Griffiths with the ball. The snap. Hands off to Williams. He's, he's got, got some run running room, David. He's, he's, got he's got a quarter over here. Can he go? Oh, and he's missed. Oh, he got ankle tackled. Great job by that young man, number 11, Wade Tobias. If he the hadn't tripped him up, tackle, that was a he touchdown. He was gone. Great job by that young man for the Bears. Look at this. He comes around that corner, David. 
And Le Levin was giving it all he had and just got just the tripped him up. back side of his ankle. Good job by that offensive line for the Pirates. Trent Grounder in the backfield now. Looks like we got a timeout time call. Pierce County. Guys, we're going to take a break with them. It's 14-14 here in the third quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We'll be right back with some Pirate action. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Welcome back, Pirate fans. This first and 10 for the Pirates on around the 44-yard line. Uh, great run by Jamari and Williams, the truck. Had to give, give him a little bit of breathing room. That Trent Griner the ball game now in the backfield. They would snap. Hands off to Griner. He's, up. Still, He's on still on his feet. He's making the He's corner. still going, David. They threw him out of bounds over there around the 40-yard line. On the 40, I thought he was closer to the 39. That was a tough four-yard game. Sure was. That boy does not give up. Now, no. the boys, he'll he'll take you and let you ride and keep on going. That's right. Great job by Trent Griner. Makes it second and six for the Pirates. Griner still in the ball game. Snap. He's caught from behind over there by number 13. Throw for a loss. Johnny Stone is what we got listed. I don't think a lot of this is correct, David. <laughs> Maybe it is. Jonathan Stone got a sophomore there. They told me earlier that they had some uh, some young players. Yeah. Uh, it's a young team. So, hey, they're stepping up and doing the job that they should be doing. Yeah, well, it's about a three-yard loss. So that's going to bring third and eight for the Pirates. Marion Williams back in the ball game. Snap. Griffiths back looking to throw. Oh, tried to get Eccles cutting across and just threw it a little too front. hard in front of him. Yep. He's going to bring it fourth down and eight for the Pirates. Looks like we're going to bring in the uh, punting team, maybe. Yeah. Or did we call a timeout? I'm not sure. I think we're in field goal range. No, we don't Which have I a think field. Allen can kick it, but actually, we do have uh, Dason, our punter, <laughs> yeah, and uh, quarterback. See if we can pin them back deep. Good, Good great kick. kick. Got a flag on the field, David. Can the Pirates get to it before well, it hits the end zone? No. Nope. We do have a flag on the play. Not sure what the flag is for. Let's see what the flag is on. Legal procedure on the Pirates. Pirates. They are going to take the ball, decline the penalty. I think they'll get it on the 25 or 30. Pirates defense got to stand strong. Show a little, uh, a little bit of resiliency here on this defense, David. We haven't been as aggressive as I've seen us in the past. Have you? No, no I sure haven't. Got to get a full head of steam and go after him. Yep. Oh, um, got to say, halftime show was really great. Uh, oh, man, County great. Pirate Brigade done a great job. Also, the uh, Pierce County Band. Yes, sir. Great show. Folks, it's everything we thought it would be. It's a tie ball game. Um, you know, you can't let records uh, talk or dictate anything on this field. That's right. This is we what we expected in some aspects. Snap, runs to the side. He was tackled immediately by 45, Edwin Burt. 
David, we got to come up with a nickname for Mr. Edwin. Yep. Well, they give him a favorable gain there. Going to make it second and nine, a gain of one. We'll, we'll come up with something, David. I know, I know it's getting right there on the tip of our tongue. Yeah, so what, what is that? Uh, Cole, what do you think? Uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll get it here in just a minute. Uh, second and nine for the uh, Bears. Still staying in that same formation, David. It's worked for him this whole time. We yep. just got to stay on top of it. That side tries to right back up the up middle. The middle. And there he is. And another gain. He's gaining about six or seven yards every time. Yep. About eight on that play. Yeah, I think our cameraman come up with a pretty good. Uh, he's up there over here. <laughs> All right, it's third and one for the Bears, David. We've got to do some uh, reassessment here and, and uh, gain some uh, momentum back. Yeah, it's pirate defense. Got to I, stand I got to get our fans fire. fired up in the stands. They got to get loud over here for our defense. Been We're not being loud enough. Find a way to stop this. Yeah. Is that number 30 back Same again. The snap. Number 30 going to the left side, and we trip him up. Tell you what, now, they're, they're still pushing us uh, backwards. And they keep running to that uh, left side this yep. whole time. That's a first down. Every time it's left side, left side, left yep. side. Yep. Hey, it's working, too. So. Hey, it's working for them. Well, he's running. They'll run to the left side, and then they'll cut back in the middle. Better have your man there waiting on him. Mm -hmm. All right, looks like we're going to take it to the fourth quarter. Pierce will. Yep. All right, it's 14-14 ball game, folks. One more quarter to go to see who wins this ball game and takes the uh, victory home with them. So, uh, guys, we're going to take a break with them here on the Village Pizza scoreboard. We'll be right back with some pirate action. We insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Community centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Pirate fans, we're back. Look at the Pirate Brigade over there being loud. We need our Pirate fans on their feet cheering and screaming and hollering. This is the fourth quarter. This is for the marbles, this is David. It. So, Pierce has got control of the game right now on offense. So, we've got to get our defense uh, motivated and get a motor motor turned up. Maybe they went and got them some fuel uh, here in this uh, next quarter. All right, they're again stacked up in that same formation. Quarterback. That same they quarterback, snap. he's still on his feet. Still, on, We wrap him up. I've noticed that whistle's getting blown a lot faster than it was earlier. Yeah, I noticed that. <laughs> they get a hold of him, and the whistle's immediately blown. Ed Williams, I think, in on the tackle. Uh, still number a lot still positive gain, though, for Pierce, uh, David, and that's what they're wanting to do. That's all they want to do is to me, slow that it down is, and grind it. That score. is smart coaching. If you're getting positive yards, you keep doing what's working. And, I, hey, I'm going to give uh, kudos where it belongs to yep. their, their head football coach. Do what works and uh, keep, keep going. Yep. All right, second and eight. Again, that same quarterback same running that ball. Up. We're not wrapping up, and he's gaining positive yards. We caught him there about two. 
think he may have gained about three, maybe four yards. Getting a good favorable spot. It's going to bring up, what, third down? No, they get him two yards. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, I thought it was about, about four yards, David. I'm sorry. Talk about two. You got to listen to me every now and then. I can't, I can't see very well, folks. I'm we looking know. at a computer screen and the back side of this play. Uh, if you're looking at our screen, we're to the right of you, straight into the right-hand corner. David and I are looking through a chain link fence and looking at a computer screen. Yeah. <laughs> and again, they're staying in this power eye or power, excuse me. Oh, wildcat type form. Oh, he found him a hole over here, David, yep. and he's still on his crease. feet. But he was thrown hard by number 55, the bulldozer, but not before he gained the first down. Again, David, they're finding holes and creases, yeah, and, and I we've think got he might have shook him up a little bit. He called for it, going off kind of a little gingerly there, bringing number 30 in. I think when Bennett wrapped him up, it kind of rattled him a little bit. First and 10 from the 49-yard line. Got people still coming in. Play clock's at 13. Bears not in no hurry. They're running a lot of clock off by running the ball. Run, but That's smart play up. again, David. Yeah, very smart play. Number 30's back play here in the backfield. Down to three, two, snap. He's taking it to the right side. A flag's yeah, right. big yeah, time flags in the air. In everywhere. Red Could helmets be a everywhere. Let's see what's called here. Flag was on the Pirates' sideline. Legal shift, I believe, is what's called there, David. I think that's what I just saw. It's going to be a five-yard penalty. So that's going to back the Bears up. Five yards it should. Yeah, it should make it first and 15. Yep. Remember when Pierce County got this turf field? It's a real beautiful field. Yes, sir. And then we come behind them and got our own yep. turf field. Both beautiful fields. All right, first and 15. Number two's in the backfield for them. He takes it to the right side. A lot of customers yep. there, and he's taking and going. The Pirates get him down. Not before he gains uh, yards. And I don't know what's going on there, David. The ball was loose. We've got a But I believe they down. called him down. We got a player down. That's number 11. Nehemiah Howard. Like a cramp. That's what it is, cramp. Folks, we're going to take a break with him, and uh, we'll be right back with some pirate action. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Welcome back, Pirate fans. Uh, there's a well, lot of movement snap. There's there. that pass over the middle. Got his man. Had a lot of movement there, David, before the ball was snapped, but no call. He hit number 11. That's Wade DiBiase. Pierce County still moving the ball down slowly, grinding off clock. Clock down to eight. Pierce is moving the ball. First and ten for the Bears. They're doing what's working, David. They're playing their game, that's right. Snap runs to that side. We miss tackles again. Washed up the left side. 
And that's another, it's close to another first down, ain't it? I'm not sure, David, on that one. It's hard to see because you can't see the sticks. Second down and three is what I'm seeing. They're on the 26-yard line. Come up in a hurry. Play clock's down to five. Number two's back there. The snap runs to the left side. He's got a He's hole. Got running room. Ed Williams grabs him from behind, but not before he gains. Still positive yards. First down. There's the play again right there. Cuts through. Good blocking out front for him. All right, still positive yards. Give them a first and ten again. Oh, yeah. They're threatening to the score, folks. Pirate defense has got to stand up. The Pirate fans are not saying a word here. There's really not a whole lot of noise on either side right yeah, at the moment. Right now it's gotten quiet. It's like everything's tense. There's that number 30 in there. Takes the snap. He's running up the middle. We meet him. But once again, positive yards. Doing what works. We're not getting no penetration on that line. Comes big Mikael Reed in the ball game. We knew this was going to be a tight ball game, David. Yeah. We sure did. I tell you what. They, they, and they're using the clock. Uh, they're doing a perfect job. Great coaching yep. on their sides. I mean, they've doing everything perfect they've right now. They've definitely had more possessions. Is that number seven in there again? He looked, and there's that pass up in the middle. Oh, and it's dropped. dropped. But he was wide open there, David. It sure was. Good job by 16, Jamarcus Robinson. He had his man, though. There it is. It stops. And just throws it up. I think it might have been deep anyway. What do you think? I know it was a pretty good throw. Just uh, Marcus just happened to be right there. Yep. Ball's on the 12. Third down, four to go. They're definitely within field goal range. Catch it, slides down, whistles come in. All start, is that right, David? Yep. That's going Got me even quiet over here, David. It's hard yeah, to see. I'm, it's but you're on the other side of the field, and, you know, we, we're, we're still – you know, trying to make sure we see what's going on here, folks. Good view right there from our cameraman back here in the stands. All right, Pierce County up to the ball. At number seven, the quarterback still. Tries to draw us off. And timeout, timeout by Pierce. Pierce. Guess we'll take a break with them, guys. It's 14-14, 453 on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Auto Owners insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if Auto Owners make sense for you. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense 
Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Welcome back. They snapped the ball. He throws the pass over to the right side, and the man was not available for that throw. Pirates take over. Pirates take over on downs. That's the first time we've held them there. That is the first time, but they've had pretty much control this second half the whole time, David. They sure have. Here's they the have again. control, control, Skin, control. He stopped and looked. He had a man there, and he just threw it over him. Of course, Treshawn Moore was right there coming hard. It's a good play call by the uh, coach. That, that could have been an easy uh, six, uh, David, for them. Yeah, sh- yep, sure could have. All right, the Pirates take over on downs. It's first and 10 from the, what, 13-yard line, David? Yep. Is that correct? Uh-huh. We got 450 on the clock. Play clock's down to seven. Got to get a little bit of sense of urgency. Snap the handoff around the end. Jamarion Williams, little running room. It goes his out. head down. Come up limping. Not a good sign there for him, but maybe he's okay. Yep. All right, it's first and 10 for the Pirates. Uh, where's the ball at on the 22-yard line? Yep. Jamario Williams coming off the field. Trent Griner back in the ball game. Snap. Hands off to Griner. Griner's on his feet, stumbling. Oh, my goodness. He had a, a hole a mile wide there, David. If he could have stayed on his feet. And that's going to be a – Trenton could have been gone. That's a first down, ain't it? Or is that one? That yeah, should that's first be down. yeah, that's first down. First and ten from the thirty-three. He come out, put his hand down, trying to keep his balance, stumble, lunge forward for several yards. You know, David, this is my third broadcast this week, and they've all been nail biters so far. Oh yeah. This this don't even compare. You know, they just Griner's wow. Still, Griner's still in the ball game. That's a snap. Hands off to Griner. Got room. Positive game. Yep. For the bull. Where did we get the bull name for Trent? Who's that he young actually, man? Actually, Bryson, my grandson, was called the bull when he brought right. fullback. And then after that, and who, after that, Trent went to Bryson and asked him, could he? No, take it wasn't name? Bryson. Huh? He, he's. Am pl- I missing one? Who am I missing? He's play. He's playing in Ohio right now. Oh, that's right. <laughs> uh, we had. Um, Jarvis Mims. Yes, sir. Jarvis Mims, you're absolutely right. Oh, we got some running room over here. Grinder. Oh, we got a flag. Thought a flag come in. Don't know what the flag is for. Looks like it's in the vicinity of hold. Pirates had positive game there. Franklin County. That ain't good. No, that's in the 10-yard vicinity. And it's going to be on Athlon County, so they're going to make back it us up. Yes, sir, should make it uh, first and uh, 20, I believe. Yep. Unless they uh, – no. Uh, let's see what that's going to be, David. It's on the 26 yard line. Yeah. Trying to get some numbers here for you. Second and 18. Is it second or first down? Second and 18. Second okay. And 18. Trying to get there with you. We need some power, power here. Hand off the grinder around the edge. Oh, he's got some he's running got some room. room. Finally hit. The Should gain only of about 31 or 32. Only gain about six yards. We need more yards than that on these plays, David. Yep. That penalty hurt. Yeah, that penalty did hurt. 
It'd be third and uh, 12, maybe. Yep. Is that right? Trying to help keep up with this for the Pirate fans. 15. All right, Pirate Power, we need you standing up. We need some, some sea water our way. Keep an option. Look, the option. Oh, he's got room. He could come. Oh, and he's tackled. What a tackles. job, but a great pitch by Dason Griffiths to the bull. Trent Griner for major that positive. That be a first down. Good tackle by that young man too, David. A tackle from behind. I haven't seen the tall sweep in a while. That was an option. Option, I'm sorry. <laughs> yes. My brain's not all there. Who was that to tackle him? I'm not sure. He come flying in Looked there. Looked like number 13, Johnny Stone. Marion Williams back in the ball game. Sounds whistles are blowing and everywhere. Looks like it's from the Pierce County. Pierce County sideline. All right, folks, we're going to take a break with him. It's 14-14 for you uh, Pirates on the Village Pizza scoreboard. We'll be right back with some Pirate action. <laughs> Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Welcome back, Pirate fans. It's uh, first and ten. Everybody's on their feet again. On the 39-yard line. Pirates. Marion Williams in the backfield. Dason Griffiths, quarterback. Snap. Hands off. No, Griffiths keeps it around the side. He's at the 30, slides down. Spots him at the 30. Gain of about nine, is that right, David? Yep. Just short of a first down, I think. No, it may be first down. No. Tell you what, they're, they're learning to spy on uh, Dason there. Dason showed a little bit of wheels there yeah, on himself. This cell. is the most we've seen him run yet. Clock's ticking. It's 153. Man, these nail biters will get to you, won't they, David? 14-14. All right. Same setup. Hands off to Williams straight up the middle. First Back down. Up. Pirates. That should move the chains. And it does. Clock still ticking, David. No, it shouldn't be. It's a minute 38. I'm sorry. I just noticed our clock was ticking. <clears throat> yep. All right, folks at home. Here it is. First and 10 for the Pirates. Jamarion Williams still in the background. Backfield. <laughs> oh, and he slips, David. Oh, he fell down. Ah, uh, cramp. Or a hamstring. I think that might have been a cramp the way he went down. He was down before the ball came out. He was yeah. hurting there, David. I yeah, hope he he's all right. The back of his leg. Yeah. But I'll tell you this. Uh, talking to Kevin a while ago, he said, man, it's hot on that field. Oh, I can imagine. They yeah. do generate a lot of heat. And it so. feels really good out here right now. The wind's blowing. It's cool. All right. It's a minute and 14 on the clock. Second and 12 for the Pirates. Clock starts. First and, uh, excuse me, second and 12 for the yeah, Pirates. Quite in field goal range. Trent Griner in the backfield. Snap. Oh, he's found a hole, but not much of one. Lunges forward for a yard or two. Looks Call like we out. got a timeout by the Pirates. Yeah, All right. Jason come up hollering timeout. 57 seconds on the clock. It is uh, going to be third and uh, I can't see. David, is it third and 10? Can't see it, but it's 14-14, guys. Yep. Here on the Village Pizza Scoreboard, we'll be right back with some pirate action. Don't Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it.
Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. All right, Pirate fans, it's third and nine for the Pirates. There's 57 seconds here in the fourth quarter. 14 to 14 on your Village Pizza scoreboard. A little closer and closer. Dacian Griffith, the quarterback. Trent Griner in the backfield. Snap. Hands off to Griner. Griner around the corner. Somebody's grabbing a hold of him, still on his feet, driving forward. I think he may be a little short, short of the first down there, David. Hard hit in there by Pierce County. Yep. Knocks him out of bounds. Should stop the clock. Stop the clock at no, the clock still. Clock still running. I'm still sorry. Running. So what do the Pirates do with the play clock at 25? Do you take it all the way down and try a field goal? And David, is that what we're doing? I don't know. We got a kicker that can do it. But, uh, but the clock, clock is, not is still stopped. running. Everybody's I think they are going to let the clock play down and try to try the field goal. Why not? Yep. You got this far down. Why don't you kick yeah. it? And that's exactly what the Pirate uh, I think that's our plan. coaches are doing. Brings it down to uh, eight seconds. And it's fourth and about uh, five is what yep. they got it marked at. I think it's actually shorter than that, David, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that's uh, – From this angle, it looks more closer, about fourth and four. Yeah, Ramirez has the leg to do it. That would be a 37-yarder. Yep, it's fourth, five, so that's – What is it? Huh. Wow. Are we still live? No, are we live? <laughs> cool. Oh, I'm sorry, I guys. We were. <laughs> <laughs> we're back. I'm sitting there looking at Chris like. <laughs> oh, you know, I'm I sorry. Told, um, here we go. Man, Alan my Ramirez, I shot. told his mama today, I said, he might be the one to win this ball game. Let's see. He's definitely got the leg. Allen the Razor Ramirez. Yep. Let's see what we got here. That's the kick. Kick is up. It is good. It's the Pirates score. Pirate 17 to <laughs> well, 14. Yet, time's clicking that. Yep. Four seconds left. Four seconds on the clock. Oh, my good. Oh, Alan Ramirez, the Razor. <laughs> the Razor. With a 37 yard field goal. What a job by Alan Mar <laughs> Ramirez. That's <laughs> what <laughs> Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I for all this. the excitement, but I don't know how much more of mine and your old hearts can handle these top games. I told his mama, I said, Alan's going to win this ball game. <laughs> Here's your replay. Look at this kick, guys. Kick is up. It Long is. And good. Nothing but good. Great job. You see the Pirate faithful there, the out-of-town team. Guys, this is where we really got to watch. Do you, I think what you do here, David, is you kick that ball out of bounds. That's the only thing you can do. You don't give them a chance don't to run it back. Don't give them a chance to return it. Boy, I tell you what, this has been a nail biter. Man, don't you know the blood is flowing through Mr. Ramirez, folks? Uh, oh, yeah. If you see that young man in town, what a what a job. This has been a nail biter of a game so far. Well, let's see what we're going to do here. They got Sloan back deep, and they got that number eight, that speedy number eight. That is Joe Drew. Yep, number five is Sloan. Carson Sloan. What do we do here, buddy? Probably going to pooch kick right here. They do. And Great do, high pooch back kick. towards Sloan over here. And they're going to throw it across. Oh, we don't have a pirate right. over there, David. Flags we got a flag down. on the field. Flags Can we tackle down. him? There is a flag, flag on, the field, on the field, folks. But and they tackle him. It is over with. That's the ball game. 
Don't matter about that flag. I think it was a forward pass, David. Wow. Got to get the players off the Let's field. Let's see what's going on here. We don't what know What a man. I knew something like wow. this. Ineligible. So that is on the Pierce County Bears. That is the ball game. Your Pirates come away with the first vi region victory, 17 to 14. The Pirates win here. Wow. What, what a, a job. Game. But I will not take away from this Pierce County faithful man. They have man, come in here a play. and give the Pirates everything they wanted here, guys. Much respect. Much, much respect for these Pierce County Bears. That could have been one play away from win right there, David. They sure was. That was a great play. We knew they weren't going to just try man. to return it like that. They Give uh, your head coach, Ryan, here an uh, applause, folks, at home, it appears. Nothing man. to hold your heads down about. These are the two powerhouses in Afflin County and Pierce County that we yes, knew was out here. Guys, this is what it's about. This is fine football at its best. At its best. South right Georgia here. football at its best, David. No My doubt about it. Good. What a ball game. If you weren't here, you missed a ball game. Man, it's it's better to see it in person than it is it away. Sure is. Folks, I'm going to tell you something. These two ball teams right here are two fine ball teams. David, I, I'm not going to take away from one or the other. No. Every folks, time we play these Bears, it is a dog fight. But I'm going to tell you folks in Applin County right now, if you see Allen, the Razor Ramirez in town, or if you don't see him, you better at least tell that young man how much you appreciate him That's and all right. the hard work that he puts in to make a 37-yard field goal. That kid works oh, just as hard as my it, God. not more than anybody. I got to say this too, uh, David, uh, Mr. Brandon Jernigan, the athletic director here in Pierce County. I want to thank you for allowing b, b Broadcasting to be here tonight. Yes. We appreciate every bit. It's been a huge help for us to be able to get set up and broadcast. You know, it's hard not to be a fan in these kind of games. I uh, try my best not to, but I also want to give a big shout-out to the Pierce County fans down here in the end zone. They have been nothing but super nice. They sure have. Uh, and, I, and I appreciate that more than they'll ever know uh, coming from an old Pirate fan. Folks, I'm telling you right here, this this is what it's about, it is. David. Uh, folks, <laughs> And My nerves have got to come. Pierce down. County, look at their players. They're coming over They're to come over to sell, uh, with celebrate with the band. To, with their band, and we do and the same. We'll be on yep. the other side. We're doing it now, uh, but guys, we're going to take a quick break because we've got to come up with our play of the game. I think I already know what it is. I don't even have to have a shadow of a doubt what it is. Yeah. But Cole, take us into commercial break, and uh, we'll be right back, guys. ensures your small business because it isn't small to you that's simple human sense ask james m swain and associates in baxley and hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in baxley if auto owners make sense for you Community centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. 
give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Falls Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. (laughs) Well, well, guys, we're back. Uh, Man, I got a smile on my face, but... You know, I can't help but look out here, David, across the fence. And, uh, you know, these kids on uh, Pierce County Bears have nothing to hold their heads down about. No. Um, two quality teams here tonight. Can't say enough about these young men. Uh, hey, keep the resilience. Keep the uh, steam rolling. Uh, you know, region uh, playoff gets here. You know, we're going to be a strong, strong region this year, I yeah. believe. Uh, I know we still got some good teams coming at us. Uh, in our region, but I'm going to tell you, I, I won't be afraid to say that these are two of the finest teams that I know oh, of. by far. Yeah, uh, great by coach, far. Uh, great coaching. Uh, you know, it was a chess match out there. It was a running game uh, type of offense. But, folks, let me tell you something. These Pirates played tough, and I, and I got to give a big shout-out to Jamari Williams. He's been uh, with an injury. I mean, really, oh, yeah, he's, he he's fought real hard he's, to get back. Uh, keep keep working hard, Jamar, and I know you got to get back in the game play. But he's going to be tough to tackle when it comes yep. uh, closer to the playoff times. And, and with uh, that being said, also Trent Griner for stepping in. And, and that's and exactly right. He's he not has, there. They're, they work well together. Great combination. Can't say enough about the Pierce County folks. And, um, guys, it really and truly for us, they've been awesome to us, and we appreciate that from the bottom of our hearts. Uh, yes. I'm sorry sometimes I become a fan during the game. Jokes aside, you know, picking about some things, and, you know, I hope nobody takes those things serious. But no, but I thank the Lord for cold over here to keep me straight sometimes. Well, we also, folks, we, um, we're we about these kids, yeah. both sides and all. I mean, we're Pirate fans, but these, the ultimate thing is these kids are is what it's all about. Um, Pierce not, County's got them a quarterback, too. That number seven. That kid is McGathy phenomenal. Is, they got some other – kids on there too that's real good that number eight number mm-hmm. two uh number five sloan number uh, six that's number, number 13 that come in they're all just great athletes that we've seen coming there doing a great job and um you know and we hope that we didn't mispronounce nobody's name tonight. Right, we, we don't mean to i promise we do because david can't spell uh, um what's that <laughs> pronounce <laughs> 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 hey, guys, we enjoyed it. I mean, we've got a smile on our face tonight. It could have been easy, been a frown. Uh, you never know in these guy- games. It always comes down to the last second with us and Pierce. That's two years in a row for the Pirates. I know they're excited. They're well-deserved. I mean, four years in a row for Pierce uh, beating us. I mean, But they beat up on us pretty man, well they, in the they past. Did. They did. They beat up on us good tonight. I That's mean, right. you look across that way, and they've got some good-looking kid yep. and good-looking athletes over there, man, they I'm really telling good. you. A uh, hard-working team. I know they're not going to go away. Oh, uh, no, no, no. This, this, these kids, knowing uh, the way Coach Aaron coaches and the, and this staff and, and, and these kids from Pierce County, yeah. this is just going to motivate them even more. That's right. The Pirates uh, come away with a 17-14 win. Uh, I have to thank Reed Lovett and Village Pizza for supplying our scoreboard just about every broadcast mm-hmm. we've had. He's taking charge of that, and we appreciate him. Go by yeah, and visit him. He come by and blew me a kiss a while ago. I don't oh, know what goodness. to think about that. Now. I'm just like, okay, <laughs> well, it means he loves you, and it, Reed's I a good guy. I that's what it is. And John Paul E. Walzen, and I said that right, too, thanks to Cole. Yep. Uh, John, you appreciate that, and thank Cole for that, because I never do get his name right, the last name. 
John, uh, but John you, we do appreciate. Boy, you better be careful. <laughs> well, no, we appreciate all our sponsorships. Uh, you know, it just it's hard to name them all because David can't write down anything. So uh, we appreciate that. But folks, with further ado, I got to say this: uh, got to congratulate our players and coaches. Man, what an awesome job by them to come away with a, uh, our first region game, come away with a victory. Congratulations to them. What some hard work and dedication they put in day in and day out, folks. You, If you ride by that football stadium, them kids are out there practicing and giving it all. It's game by game. Take it every game by game. And they've right. been doing that so far. And the sky's the limit. But with all that said, David and I always like to do a play of the game, uh-huh. player of the game. Um and this is what we chose and our cameramen chose. Yeah. And I think Cole's even in favor of this. Cole. This guy don't never get any respect. I, I'm just going to go ahead and say it, even That's in right. the NFL and college. But this young man deserves it. And, David, I'm going to let you call it because you said it. You call it. That's right. The play of the game tonight, folks, is the last, well, pretty much the last play that we played. Mr. Allen Ramirez. The last score, guys, three points. With the field goal. Here it comes. To win the ball game. This is it right here. This is for all the marbles. Eight seconds left on the clock. The hold was good. The kick was up long and straight through the uprights. Guys, if you see the excitement in that field and in those stands by these Pirate fans, it was unbelievable. Yep. Uh, man, what a job by Allen Razor Ramirez. Y'all, please, if you see that young man, Congratulations, Facebook message. Well, we don't care. Kid. Go, he, go man, he's him. a fine young man. His mom is a super sweet lady. Uh, we get to speak to her all the time, and uh, she loves to ask us about football. So, That's right. Uh, all right, w- brother. want to thank these young men behind yep. us from Pierce. They've been some great fans and great folks, and uh, really appreciate the hospitality they've given us, and uh, really want to thank the That's athletic right. director again, uh, Mr. Jernigan, for, for all they've done for us and allowing us to be here. And, That's right. Uh, folks, Wow. David, That's all wow. I can say is wow. I mean, Man, great, great game. I know you missed two me. broadcasts. These girls have said if Mr. David don't come, if Mr. David don't come and uh, at least uh, help Chris broadcast at least one of these games this week, that because you're fired. You know what? It, you're no. the number three. To, they know I'm the number one guy. No, That's why they need me no, there. You're See, still, you, you just messed yourself nope, up on that one. <laughs> nope. I got to tell you, somebody took your two spot, and he did it last night. Who? Andy. Oh, Andy does a great. Andy's job. awesome. Yeah. He's way better than you. I, no, he's better than you. So no, you. That's the thing about it. So if I come back, you love to get <laughs> pretty much. But yeah. guys, Monday night we're going to be live again. We're going to go cheer on our lady volleyball team, and I'm going to I'm going to say this: we need the fans to show up that volleyball game. It's at six o'clock. It's senior Pack night. The house. Pack the house. Pack the house. Who are we playing, Cole? My brain just went dead. We're playing Windsor, Windsor Forest. Forest, so we're going to be at home. Come celebrate these young ladies, and you're going to see night, some ain't? great action, man. Yep. Oh my God. Kira is and Miss McDaniel are yep. two of the greatest Saints singers McDaniel, you ever see. Just, We're looking know, forward to that. Please pack the house, bring your friends, your family, everybody. Bring them on. Softball too next Softball week, too. and bring another football on. game. So bring we're going to be action packed next week. As I always like to say, folks, I'm a pirate for life. I will be forever. Thank you for allowing us to do this and bring this into your homes and into your phones. And we appreciate everything Appling County does and the and the following folks do. Thank, you, thank thank these folks here at Pierce County. Just great folks, man. Enjoyed it tonight, David. I'm gonna say this: Go Pirates! All right. Also, go Pirates and beam me up, Cole.